all right guys welcome to the project we are looking at web start debugging 4. once you are here so the first thing you want to do ensure that you are working in ubuntu 40 version 14.04 um, uh, ubuntu version ensure you are in that version so how do you check because uh come on i've worked on i've i've tried this on other version version 16 version 20 it did not work all right so how do you check that version of ubuntu just use this command right here this command lsb release minus a so if i hit enter of course we are working on the web terminal so it's going to show you this this is the version and show you are using this version so after that okay. so the next thing we want to do we want to update the system and install um apache so first on it so you run this command so i'll enter okay we are done with that so again after that you run the command to install let me think okay but you are going to see what i'm in here so after that you run the command to install apache yeah this is it so i'll hit enter so you want to do at this point we want to System file. Let's see the limit. Okay. All right. So you run this command sudo or uh, vim um, and want to go into this ingenious ingenious file. So if I hit enter, it's going to show us. All right. You can see that. These are the limits we have. So what we want to do, we want to set um, this limit to 4096. So that is our goal. And you are not supposed to set it manually. So we are going to be um, um, setting that limit using puppets. So you are not supposed to change it here. So we are go just I just showed you this. Okay. So we are going to change that. We are going to change that um right away so so let me exit okay so how do we do that so you are going to create a file name you are going to do pi okay you are going to create this file you are going to create this file okay and hit enter I already have the creator even if i hit it. okay so you're going to create this file you're going to enter into this content uh, content and what you want to do uh, basically you want to change the limit to 4096 from 15 so i'm just going to go into here so and i'm going to have this status in and uh, 4096 here i want to do change this in we are increasing the u limit i'll change this to 15 i'm going to change this thousand all right just like that so after that the next command we have here sudo service nginx restart. so after we change that we are going to restart nginx basically that is what we have here okay so basically uh that's it escape column wq i'll hit it all right so after changing that we want to run puppet that file so you go back to your intranet and the what you are want to do okay we want to apply puppet on that file so applying puppet is going to help us you know infect the changes which we made in the created file copy this go back to here and what i want to do this and if i hit enter
okay so just give it some time and you are going to notice after doing this we go back to that configuration file and you discover uh we check if the changes we made uh, took place so after that you are sure okay ronnie pipette is going to do that and restart nginx so let's go back to operation file let's see if the changes we made took place so uh, as you can see yeah it's going to increase the limit all right it's going to change that to 1096 so yeah right there so after that you skip column wq you save on yeah that's what you need to do after that you are going to push that file you created this um, file you are going to open it github so that's it guys that is what you need to do here that is what you need to do here so after that then let's check if we still have um feed request so what you want to do we want to run apache so we want to run this command just you know let's see if uh uh feed request If I hit enter, I'm going to run that. All right, so you can see right here, the request is zero. So uh, initially it was at 934 feed request, but right now it's zero. That's it that I have to do. Okay, try it out and let me know before we hit the next one. All right, guys for this um second tax user limit what we want to do we want to change the operating system configuration so that it's possible to log in with operating user and open a file without any error message um what are we doing here guys what we are doing is that you see if we try to open to um um, login or button you uh, as a super user is going to return too many open files why is that because the in the security um config file the number of um the number of the value for hard and soft of obatin is set to a particular limit i think in this case it's going to be four and five that means why is four four because uh it shows that the number of files that can be opened at um at a particular point in time so that is why if you try to do this it's going to return too many files right you're going to see this error too many open files too many open files and all of that so that is why we want to um, change this configuration so that it's going to allow us to put as many files as possible in both hard and soft of button i believe you understand that please before we continue like and subscribe to this channel if you are getting value so we are going to go back here and what we want to do um let me list again okay so what we want to do we first we want to check want to check the uh intc security limits to see um the soft and hard the value the hard for whole button so do vi and um, vi to the limit dot config file so enter and let's check yeah right here so all button had the values for and for soft the values five what does this mean uh for this uh for it shows that it says the absolute maximum number of open files that the user whole button can have at any given time so once this limit is reached it's going to it will not allow you to open any more files that's why we get too many error, uh, many files when we try to do that so um, the user will uh, will not be able to open any more files or they we uh we change the value then for for soft soft um is the threshold for the number of files the user whole button can have so when the number of open files reaches this limit the system will we attempt to free up some resources by closing files that are no longer needed right so um i believe you quite get that explanation that is why you're having that error so we want to go ahead change that value we are not doing it here please take note of that you are not changing the value here 
Let me exit. So let's apply puppet on the file. So I'm going to do puppet. Let me see. All right. So puppet apply. Then the name of the file. Yeah, we are. Let's just hold on for some time. All right, applying puppet on the file. All right, so okay, it's done applying that. So what we want to do now? We want PD or VI into the security file. Right. So let's see if that change. Right. All right. Right there, so you can see it has increased the uh, the limit for both soft and hard of all button. It has changed it to five thousand. So that means the number of files I have now, we can open as many files as possible, and it's not going to show us the error too many files. So what we want to do now, um, if we come here, what we want to do now, since we have executed that successfully, so we want to check. Try logging in here again. So if we do S, then. all right so that is it guys so it's going to it's going to show us this similar to we have on on the intranet there okay. but anyway if you try to log in as a super user to hot button and you are experiencing that hot button does not exist there is a way you can fix that all right so you could come here and create um the user hot button create this user uses this command then you could verify that uh, it exists and after doing that you could try logging in again with the um, command all right so you could try that once you are done if it doesn't work let me know in the comment section and we can fix that together all right so um it's going to show us that it's going to show that that was successful all right that is it guys that is just all you need to do you push your files to it up Okay, so after doing that, you're gonna push it hard, you commit, and let me as okay. all right. So that's what you need to do. You push, and it's going to be fine. You're going to um, have green ticks. Um, thank you. Subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you.